Hello everyone, this is h 2 on here from Online Nights, and I'm here today with another map feature for you guys from the Master Chief Collection. This is Inhibit by Fallen Legend, and it is a free-for-all map in Halo 2 Anniversary. Um, oh, we're playing here with Slayer. The map, I don't think is set up for King of the Hill, but I know Oddball is um, something you can run on here. Um, and Oddball, I often find, is quite fun uh, with free-for-all maps. Um, so yes, this is for a small player counts. We're playing here with four. I believe recommended count is uh, two to six, as with most of Fallen Legends free for all maps. Um, and yeah, it's interesting because it's one of the few maps I've seen so far in the Master Chief Collection that hasn't been built on a wash, which seems to be the most popular canvas. It's actually been built on Nebula, which is for those who are not already aware, kind of just a complete straight copy of Impact from Halo 4, it's got the exact same skybox. Um, but yeah, so the the slight sort of palette changes I think are quite nice, the map's coloration is all quite cool to look at. And it's just something new compared to what we've been seeing a lot of so far from the wash. But so as for the uh, as for the map itself, there are two power weapons to take note of, one being the sniper rifle which spawns down in that kind of pit down there at the bottom of the map so you need to sort of do some work to get to a good position where you can use it um, if you can't get up to that ridge over that uh, you saw um, I was fighting at earlier which is one of the sort of main focal points of the map you can get up to this perch up here now this platform is a really good position if you're if you're better with a sniper than I am uh, I do get a kill I do get one kill that was cool but um yeah, um, so it's generally a pretty good position, um, though you are a bit exposed and there are, as you can see, some decent line of sight blockers. Um, yeah, if you're any good with the sniper, you can get a couple kills from up here. Not that it's overpowered at all, as, as I said, it's pretty open and it takes some effort to get up to. So as well as the sniper rifle, you've also got, it's not so much a weapon, but it is definitely something you want to, definitely considered to be a power weapon, and definitely want to control it, it's the overshield just there, which spawns right in the middle of a really open area, so you're really exposed when you're rushing to get it, but um, if you're dual wielding with the overshield, you'll be absolutely fine. So these are the players I'd like to thank for their time, helping us test and play the map, we had a very fun game, and very competitive game it turned out to be, um, people taking it way too seriously in the end. Um, yeah, so we had a lot of fun. Um, I'd recommend giving the map a try. Uh, if you've got a bunch of people and none of you can be bothered to actually work here as a team, then play this, get some good free-for-all going. And just have a lot of fun. Anyway, this has been Inhibit by Fallen Legend. If you'd like to get your map feature like this, then please click the link, please click the link at the end of the video, which we'll have in the description. Likewise, if you want to download the map, we'll also put download links in the description as soon as we can. I've been H. Raycon from Online Nights, and I will see you guys next time.